Saturday night UFC Fight Night 206 features a women's bantamweight bout in the main event between former champion Holly Holm and sixth rank Caitlin Vieira. Let's break it down. Caitlin Vieira is 30 years old. She's 5'8 with a 68 inch reach and a record of 12 and 2 with two knockouts and four submissions. From Anos, Amazonas, Brazil, Vieira took up Brazilian jiu jitsu and judo at the age of 12, going on to win the Brazilian National Wrestling Championships before transitioning over to MMA, where she made a professional debut in October of 2014 with a second round knockout of Juliana Letit. She won her next five with one knockout, three submissions before making her UFC debut two years later with a close split decision over Kelly Fassholes. She followed it up with a unanimous decision over Ashley Evans-Smith in a second-round arm triangle choke submission of former Olympic silver medalist Sarah McCann. In March of 2018, she edged out Kat Zingano with a hard-fought split decision. However, three months later, she suffered her first loss when she took on the dangerous and hard-hitting Irene Aldana before getting knocked out cold by a thunderous counter-left hook at the end of the first round. After having several proposed matches canceled for visa issues, she returned on September 27, 2020, scoring a unanimous decision in a back-and-forth slugfest with Sahara Eubanks, but four months later, she missed weight and was fined 20% of her purse when she took on former Invicta Bantamweight champion Anna Kunitskaya, losing via unanimous decision. In November of 2021, she bounced back with the most significant victory of her career when she took on Misha Tate, using her reach and slick counter-striking to overwhelm the former Bantamweight champion en route to a convincing unanimous decision victory. An aggressive pressure fighter, Vieira possesses heavy hands and world-class wrestling skills, averaging three punches per minute while boasting a near-perfect 90% takedown defense. Holly Holm is 40 years old. She's 5'8 with a 70-inch reach and a record of 14-5 and five with eight knockouts. From Albuquerque, New Mexico, home, a naturally gifted athlete, got into combat sports at the age of 16 when her cardio kickboxing instructor recognized her potential as a fighter. After a successful kickboxing career that saw her go 14-1, and she embarked on perhaps the most illustrious career in women's boxing history, amassing a record of 33-2-3 with nine knockouts and defending her title 18 times across three weight divisions before making her MMA debut in March of 2011 with a second-round knockout of Christina Domke. Over the next three years, she went 7-0 with six knockouts, winning the inaugural Legacy FC Women's Bantamweight title with a fifth-round head kick knockout of Juliana Werner before making her UFC debut in February of 2015 with a split decision over Raquel Pennington. In her next fight, she shook up the MMA world when she pulled off one of the biggest upsets in UFC history, using her superior striking skills and boxing experience to completely overwhelm Bantamweight champion and UFC legend Ronda Rousey, continually defending her takedown attempts and landing powerful counter punches before winning the title in the second round with a vicious head kick, followed by ground and pound. Her success was short-lived, however, as four months later, she would lose her title to Misha Tate via rear naked choke after four rounds of intense back-and-forth action. Back-to-back -back losses to current pound-for-pound -pound queen Valentina Shevchenko and Jermaine Durandame before a brutal head-kick knockout of Beth Correa put her in line to challenge Chris Cyborg for the UFC featherweight title, which she lost via a close and action-packed unanimous decision. She bounced back six months later with a measured and dominant decision over Megan Anderson before returning to Bantamweight to challenge champion Amanda Nunes for the title, getting knocked out by a perfectly timed head kick near the end of round one. After recovering from a hamstring injury, she returned in January of 2020 with a dominant win over old rival Raquel Pennington, and nine months later put on a near-perfect performance against number six-ranked contender Irene Aldana, mixing in vicious combinations with multiple takedowns en route to a wide unanimous decision. Widely regarded as one of the greatest female boxers of all time, Home is a hard-hitting counter-striker who maintains distance with a combination of excellent lateral movement, a solid jab, and a variety of high and low kicks, and remains the only fighter, male or female, 
to be a world champion in boxing as well as the UFC. Can Vieta use her superior wrestling skills to add another MMA legend to her growing resume? Or will a preacher's daughter dominate with her counterpunching and experience as both women seek a shot at Bantamweight gold? Tune in Saturday night to UFC Fight Night Home versus Vieta, and let's find out.